It is important to correctly set up and calibrate the photometer prior to use so you can accurately measure a pair of glasses. The various parts of the photometer are the eyepiece adjustment ring, the protractor ring, the power switch, the lens holder, the lens holder lever, the lens stop, the lens table, the diopter power wheel, the axis wheel, the tilt locking lever, and the battery compartment. In order to calibrate the photometer, you need to ensure the instrument is calibrated for your eye's refractive error. To begin, press the power switch located beneath the eyepiece. This lights the lamp in the photometer. It is important to note that the lamp will automatically turn off after five minutes to save power. You will need to turn it on again if this happens. Next, look down the eyepiece. You should see a view like this. The black concentric circles are collectively called the reticule or measuring scale. Now you will need to focus the reticule, adjusting for your own refractive error. To focus the reticule, turn the rubber eyepiece adjustment ring in either a clockwise or counterclockwise direction until your view is focused. Once the reticule is in focus, the instrument will be properly calibrated for your eye's refractive error. Now that your view has been focused, you will need to rotate the diopter power wheel so that the diopter scale, the window shown beneath the reticule, is set to zero. As you adjust the diopter power wheel, you will notice that this focuses the pinhole corona and cross lines. The pinhole corona and cross lines appear in green. The reason for the use of green monochromatic light is to avoid any effect which may arise from chromatic aberration if white light were used. Once you have successfully calibrated the photometer, you will be ready to mount your glasses and measure the lens strengths. The three main steps to get you on your way to proper instrument use are Switch on the photometer. Focus the eyepiece adjustment ring so that the reticule or measuring scale is in focus. Rotate the diopter power wheel, adjusting the diopter scale to zero.